everyone! Welcome to What's Up Kids! Today we continue our Easter celebration. As you know, Easter isn't just one day, it's an entire season that lasts for several weeks. During Easter, we remember that Jesus is the cornerstone of our faith. Now, you might be thinking to yourself, Jesus is the corner what? What on earth is a cornerstone? Great question. A cornerstone is an important part of any building. It's the stone that all other stones are built around. Jesus is called the cornerstone because we build our faith around Jesus. Jesus holds everything we believe together. In today's true Bible story, Peter addresses a new community of believers. He compares new Christians to newborn babies who need milk to grow. Take a look at this picture. What things do people need in order to grow? People grow in many different ways. Just as people need sleep, exercise, and well-balanced meals to grow from babies to strong, healthy kids, God's love fills us with love so our faith can grow. In order to strengthen our own Easter lives and become a collective spiritual house of faith, let's dive into today's Bible story. Far away from Jerusalem, people began to hear the good news about Jesus, and they believed. Across mountains and seas, from the largest cities to the smallest towns, messengers carried letters. New believers wanted to learn how to follow Jesus. One believer wanted to honor Jesus' disciple Peter. He wrote a letter to encourage everyone to believe. Dear friends, God is calling you. Come out of the darkness of life without God. Come into the light of God's love. Before you believed, you were alone. But now you are God's own people. You are a part of God's family. God is at work in you. God is building a strong faith in you. Piece by piece, your faith is growing. God is filling you with love. God is teaching you how to care for each other. Because you believe, you know how important it is. A life without God is filled with rocks that make you stumble and fall. Without faith in God, you are alone. No one will help you get up. But you are God's beloved. God will help you when you fall. God will protect you. God will care for you. Milk helps babies grow. God's love helps our spirits grow. With God's love, we are kind. With God's love, we are fair. With God's love, we are family. Pass this letter to other new believers. Go and tell others about God's love. With Jesus as the cornerstone, God is building a strong faith in you. In order to let these emotions and major themes sink in, take a few moments and discuss the following with your family. How did the good news about Jesus spread from city to city? Who makes our faith grow? When we have God's love, what are we like? Who is in your church family? What do you enjoy about being in God's family? God is building a strong faith in each of us. Jesus is the cornerstone of our faith. Together with God's guidance, we are a strong, united family of faith. Who do you want to thank for helping your faith grow? To help you ponder your response and make even more faithful discoveries, we have provided a number of activities for you and your family on the Kids at Home page, which is located on our Holy Cross website. But before you begin your activity, or head off to your next thing, I'd love to pray with you. So if you wanna fold your hands or hold your elbows, close your eyes so you're not distracted by what others may or may not be doing around you, and then we're gonna get really quiet as we talk to the one who created us. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you for our time together in What's Up Kids. 
We love coming together to hear your good word. Dear Jesus, thank you for being our cornerstone. You make our faith strong. We are happy to be part of God's family built on you. Amen.